Little Gardener right here, but not right there. <gasps> Who's that? Billy Volker Brown. Good Yay! morning. Narrator extraordinaire and lovely, lovely person all round. <laughs> and it's another audiobook blast in association with... ACA. That's the Audiobook Creators Alliance. I like the jingle. I think we're going to keep that. Thanks. We yeah. should do. We should I'll do. Uh, copyright it. So today's audiobook blast in association with the ACA, who should join because they're free and fun and fabulous and other F words are available in a nearby dictionary. Go find them. They're fun. Uh, is all about... What's it all about? It's kind of clothing. Sort of studio etiquette, but... Yeah, not just being nice. Yeah. Sort no, of no, no. We've got another video do. on that. Things we? to do yeah. and not do. Yeah, so the things to think about when you're going into a studio or your own booth, of course, at home, um, but mostly to do with clothing, really, uh, from particularly from a gentleman's point of view. So from a gent's point of view, think about the clothing you're going to be wearing in the studio because it can all make noise. That's the thing. But also studios can get quite warm. Um, so, for example, when I go into narrate, I always have a shirt, obviously, but I have a T-shirt underneath. This one's got a cat on it, of course. Uh, no surprise there. And so if it's getting really warm, I can take this off, but still not reveal all my exciting manliness to the world. Um, things like leather belts for gentlemen um think about that about quite creaky mm -hmm. around the belly area so you might want to change it to a plastic belt or just undo the belt don't worry we're not looking i promise you you your, your, your privacy is secure at least here i can't promise for every <laughs> studio <laughs> um uh, also um after shave uh, mm. deodorants it's nothing too aggressive Go easy. yeah because someone else is gonna have to follow you at some mm. point and it's quite hard to air out booths um so stuff like that um taking your shoes off having a nice pair of socks do walk around in your socks it's really nice it feels good uh, it's good for the feet as well don't get sweaty toes and um, so for the gents that's kind of the things to do but what about ladies um so yeah ladies uh perfume in a similar vein to aftershave don't wear perfume into the booth really at all if you want to go out afterwards for dinner take it in your bag put it on afterwards oh. if someone's going to go into the booth after you it can be overpowering for them they might not like the smell but it might affect their throat also which is that's more true. important Actually, yeah. um think about what you're wearing jewelry wise essentially don't wear jewelry don't wear dangly earrings don't wear anything if you're going to wear cans it's going to hurt and jangle don't wear things like dungarees the clasps are going to jangle again belts anything like that something a crunchy shirt a crunchy oh, yeah. anything with a zip if you've got like a zip on the back of your jumper don't wear it anything that's going to jingle leave it at home yeah or remember to take it off before you go in the booth at least and have a little true. bag to put it in true Somewhere. and if it gets cold like neil was saying take some bed socks take something cozy if you know you're a person that gets cold take a scarf that you can pop over your knees yeah. and have layers that you can take off if you get too hot so billy always has the fluffiest socks I've ever seen. I do have very fluffy very socks. Very fluffy socks. Yeah. And for everyone actually, is one I always forget, ticking watches. Oh, uh, yeah. I know most people have like smart watches or digital watches. And Fitbits that beep if you get a message. Things that beep, turn mm -hmm. off all the sounds on Vibrate. your iPads, vibration, all that, mm -hmm. all that exciting stuff. But particularly <laughs> watches, if you're into that kind of new thing of having an old retro star watch with actual mm. ticking motion, yeah. um, the mics can pick it up. So take it off. Yeah. Um, you know, we'll make sure there's a secure place for it. Or, you know, you can still bring it in the booth with you, but put it in the bag at the very furthest point away from the microphone. Um, and just, you know, don't leave it there at the end that's of the true. day. That's all. So that's really it, I think, yeah, isn't I it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, just, you know, be fabulous, be fun, be friendly. And we'll see you again for another Audiobook Blast soon. See ya. Bye.